Say what? Hey guys, welcome back to the Headcase Showcase. This is episode 16 of the Headcase Showcase, and we're on Sword of the Samurai. Ooh, we're one to know with this deck, by the way. I'm not really feeling this. I think I gotta toss it back. Uh, maybe, do I? I actually thought this was double glory of warfare, so now that I see this is Lightning Helix, I think I'm, I'm gonna keep it. Uh, definitely lay planes first main on the first turn because Hand of Honor is gonna be coming down on. Uh, uh, just show me Dead Walkers. That's white. That is not black. Pro black is gonna be irrelevant this game, unfortunately. All right, so lay my planes. All right, I drew an equipment. I mean, that's kind of really what I want to be doing is laying those those equipments and. Oathkeeper Takeno's Dice Show really doesn't get enough credit. I mean, that's I mean, three plus three is really, really relevant. I mean, that makes every single creature of yours a threat. And the fact that all of your shit is samurai, I don't think I run a single non samurai creature, do I? Don't think so. I mean, it, it should not be um, taken for granted. It is the worst equipment in the deck that I'm running, but I don't know why I would cast that first man. I guess he tapped out, so it doesn't matter. I'm playing Absence Glory. That's all we see in the showcase, I think. We've seen that deck more often than the rest of them, I think. I would venture to say. We've seen Chant? Ah, uh, maybe not. I do remember playing against Abs against Absence Glory. Uh, that's fine because I can Lightning Helix and then equip up my Dice Show and swing back in. So, really don't care about that. Fumiko, the low blood, is sick. Um, I'll do that. So, Helix... Oh shit, I just flashed that, didn't I? That is definitely an honor of the pure that's out there. God. Oh, alright, so he knows I have a lightning helix. Sorry, I thought that was a 1 3. That is definitely a 2 4. So, Fumiko, you're going to have to do it for me. Creatures your opponent's control attack each turn if able. Cool. Bushido X, where X is the number of attacking cre. cre wh what? Ooh! So that thing has Bushido 1 right now, because that dude has to swing in. So that thing is, I'm about to kill his dude. He's got to kill my dude right now. That's how good Fumiko is. She is sickness. So, uh, yeah, I don't know what the deal is with the misplays with this deck. I'm going to try to keep that to um, an all-time low. Oh, ring. Unforge. I have no way of taking care of that. So, oh, man. That is bad. I need something with feet. I need something that can walk around and kick people. Because if not... We're moving into one in one territory with this deck. The Lightning Helix play I don't think is going to cost. Oh, shit, yes. That is so good. Ooh, God, that's awesome. But, like, I mean, he could have another Path to Exile. He could have another Oblivion Ring, another Fiend Hunter. I mean, there's a lot of things that deck can do. But, I mean, he's surely he's running out of removal. Please tell me, because this thing is sickness right now. Thirty Madoon Sayer, don't care. Ooh, I don't care. Alright, so I will on my next turn. Oh, next turn is going to be sick for me. Because I have a pro white. I got a pro white sword. Um, this three been Doomsayer, like, hat. I mean, uh, the, the, uh, the, uh, the, uh, Champion of the Parish has to die. I think, or does the three been Doomsayer have to die? No, the Champion of the Parish has to die. Alright, so this thing has Vigilance, so I can swing in with him and still activate his ability. Oh my gosh, that is ridiculous. Alright, that's what I'm going to do. Mm. I think I want a Helix. So I have three left. I'll probably do... It's two and two. Okay, yeah. Swing in. Uh, wait for it, kind sir. I need to go get... Uh, yeah, that's fine. Go get me a pro white. Where you at? Ooh, Jatiti seems pretty good too, but... Pro white is just a play. It's gotta be, right? Pro white's a play. I think pro white's better than Jatiti right now. I think so. Whoop. Alright, Lightning Helix, Creature, Champion, Suck on my dick, Avis's Glory! Have you noticed that Avis's Glory really hasn't had that uh, successful of a run against uh, the, in the Headcase Showcase? Like, I don't think I've lost it. I've lost one game to Avis's Glory, I think. Maybe two. I can only remember one. I don't know why he's creating a creature right now, but go ahead, bro. 
and then he dipped. <laughs> yes. yes. Oh man, I love the showcase. I, I still like my play with uh yeah, obviously I get pro white, right? Like that's just the play, my dudes. That's just the play. Can I afford? Yeah, I can. Uh Glory of Warfare. Equip up Takeno and uh that's lethal, my my kind sirs. Oh, that's sick. Yeah, let's get another one. That got me... Oh, that got me ready. That got me ready for the week. Happy Sunday, by the way, guys. I hope you're having a good one. I'm having an even greater one. I I can't wait to like hear the cadence in my talking from the beginning of this video like to the middle. It'll go like up and then back down because I'm playing Abyss's Glory and I'm like tank on a couple of turns. And then I just realized I could just smoke that motherfucker and then I get super excited. Now I'm like this. Do you hear this? Endorphins are pumping. It's going to be a good video. I'll see you next game. Bubbles. Oh, we got some fubble action going on. Sweet. All right, guys. Thanks to that stone hewer giant, we're now 2-0. A timely stone hewer, I'd say. Oh, I guess I should say that I threw in a Yose. And I caught um, one of the enchantments. Shit. Whatever the four mana enchantment is. I cut one of those. Oh, shit. Do I, do I want to keep this? No. I want to draw a new hand. Uh, keep. I could get fucked on this. Yeah, I, I trimmed the deck a little bit. I, I think Yose should be put in. I was reading some forums and... Uh, some other builds I was just doing some research on. I really like it, even though I didn't play to test it anymore. I just really think it's going to be best for ha to have him in there. He's really strong. Uh, so I bumped the land count, count up to 24, and I cut an enchantment. I forgot what I cut. Oh, the fucking three, the, the, the three mana uh, bolt to the creature can't attack thing. That thing. I cut that. Uh, I, I didn't want that in the deck in the first place, so I'm really okay with that cut. Yeah, sorry. I should have told you all about that. I actually forgot I did it. Um, so here we go. One and two. Looks like we're playing the mirror. Because every time I see that planes, I don't know about y'all, the planes is on my mine and his battlefield. Every time I see that planes, I think there's like something on the card. Like I want to physically like get up on my screen and like scratch it off. Like that it's just so weird. Is that a stump? I've never looked at that planes up close. It's it throws me off though. Playing the mirror, so lightning helix is gonna be very good. Oh, double lightning helix. That's also good. I'll take it. Oh, bash in. Man, I want that other. Fumiko is the tits. Ooh. That bitch is nuts. Nutter butter tastic. Love it, man. That card is sick. Like, I didn't think about how cool that card was. Double red's a little awkward in this deck because I'm, I'm running a lot of white because I want to hit my one drop whites like uh, Isumaru, Hound of Konda. But, man, she is so good. She's so good. And Devoted Retainer. Devoted Bracers. I hate that. I hate that card's name. Reminds me of Dentistry. Alright, Stone Hewer. This card's good, guys. I know it's slow, but I mean, it's a big old 5-5. Five, five. I mean, it's a big old 5-mana 4-4 four, four with Vigilance. And a sick ability. Tutor Up Attach? Do I have to pay for it? Tutor Up Attach? Hey, that is the very first time I've ever seen Zealous Conscripts in my Grippums. So that's nice. I'm bashing. Um, do I just kill that thing? I think I'm cool with trading the hound for that. Am I? Mm, no, I don't think I am. Let's go ahead and kill it. Keep the pressure up. I think I, th another problem with this deck is I don't really know if it should be super aggro. Like, I'm going the aggro route, but I don't really know if this deck should be ran like super aggressive we'll see though that's how i have it built i have a bunch of one drops i wish i had some equipment that'd be nice um or a land i want a mountain a montagna do your worst deck oh that's not that bad so that's definitely worth a helix bash in for four he's down to eight after that zealous conscripts is so good it doesn't look like it belongs in this oh yeah we'll see you <laughs> we'll see ya! Uh, has Bushido X Rex the number of attack creatures? Yep! Uh, shit. Do I attack? I don't think so. I definitely don't attack with Isamaru. Do I attack with this and, uh, and offer the trade? No, because he swings in and dies to this. Right? No, 3-3, three, 3-1, three, three, no, they would trade. No, he wouldn't even trade. He would just kill it. Uh, 
I love that it says number of attacking creatures, so it could be offensive and defense. Oh, shit! Legendary rule does not apply to this game. I was going to say that... I don't know if I'd be on them aggro sticks, my dude. Think about what you're doing. Yeah, there we go. I mean, that's not good because I have a Helix. I'm going to Helix the Fumiko, and then he's not going to have profitable blocks at all. He could trade this, but he definitely can't uh, block the Fumiko. I'm okay with that. That is a terrible attack, dude. That's bad, my dude. Yeah, the thing's a three first strike, so I cannot. I really don't want to trade, yeah. I'm just going to Lightning Helix. Ooh, shit. I could just, um, if I draw the land, Zealous Conscripts Bash, that's 3, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And then just Helix them next turn for the, yeah. That's what I'm going to do. He could have Lightning Helix too, I guess. Yeah, give me your shit. This thing has haste. Oh, is that game? Choose what you, oh, my god, I can sack his. Which one did I just take? This one? Holy shit, did I just take this one? <laughs> Holy fuck. No, because that has haste, right? Alright, oh my god, this is nuts. How much time do I have? Holy fuck. Okay, it gains haste only in a turn. Okay, it says this thing has haste. So I think it's this one. Choose which permanent to keep. This one. So I just killed his shit! Oh! I didn't even mean to do that! That is so sick! Oh, man. Hey, <laughs> scream warning at so many seconds, because I just freaked. That was nuts. Oh, that was nice, man. That was sick. I didn't even think about it. At first, I was like, oh, holy fuck. I screwed up really, really bad, but yeah, that is... Oh, that's beautiful. That's not going to do it, Moth Rider. Dude, how much shit is on Moth in this deck? This isn't a Samurai deck. This is a Moth deck. Is there like a Moth Rider? Yeah, no shit, dude. There's so many Moths in this deck. <laughs> oh, we'll see ya. We will see ya, my dude. That was nasty. Hey, there's... I mean, Zealous Conscripts is really strong. Um, that was like a crazy interaction there uh, that I'm still pretty stoked about. That was... What are the odds of that? Oh, that was sick. That's only, that's only gonna happen in the mirror. Oh, man. That was sweet. There's the other moth. I mean, it's just like fucking moth city. Alright, yeah. Nug. See ya, brother. That was awesome. That made that was such a good way. We're 3-0 oh with a samurai deck. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go again. I'm not surprised anymore. Apparently, I don't track my win-loss record with decks. But, uh, yeah, we're 3-0. Oh. I'll see y'all next episode. Oh, shit! That was sick.